Well, I'm back to my Victoria 2 Korea New World Order mod playthrough as it's 2047. As I remember in the last episode, I was considering getting ready to attack the Far Eastern Republic. It's a good thing I didn't check I me mean, do it yet because I just found out China's on the verge of sphering them. I mean, well, at least being friendly with them. And that would be an epic disaster for me. But, I actually have ways to counteract that, which I'm going to do right now. I think I can lower the relationship. There we go. Now I'm safe. And I also, I'm actually also trying to influence Far Eastern Republic 2. That way I can ban China's embassy. That way they won't be able to influence them as I get ready to attack them probably soon. Alright, so with that in mind, I think it's time for me to get my troops ready into position for when we possibly attack. As I gotta go pick up these troops. That's right, I forgot about that. Go over here. Drop them off at Seoul. I think now I can go... Yeah, here we go. <clears throat> Acquire a state. I still gotta ban them. That way I don't have to worry about them. Oh my god, of course they, America has to kick me out of the Republic of Arabia. Of oh, fucking course. And I need to remove the um, gender rights crap. That way my population will go back up. Because that's really, really badly hurting me. But good luck getting that repealed. That is not going to be easy. It's very difficult to repeal laws if unless you're um, like a authoritarian. Very, very difficult, actually. And of course, I'm stuck with these stupid troops I don't really want. All right, let's see. Okay, come on, get the 40. And get the 50. Ah, damn it, got caught. Well, hurry up and get up to um 65. That way I can ban their embassy for a year. That would secure it at least. And I heard a ship get built. I think, yeah, okay, I got troops being built. And of course, I have no idea. Did I ever build these missiles yet? I don't know if they're useful yet or not. Yeah, I still got all these stupid drones. Yeah, do that. Okay, got more infantry. You're all mechanicized. Okay, you're all mechanicized infantry. It's good. Need to keep. Oh my god, my relationship with China is not that good. I got really fix that very soon. Especially since they have a core on me so they can attack me anytime they so please, which is not really that good. Fix a relationship with them really quickly. So let's see. Ooh, I'm getting close to being neutral with them. I mean lower into neutral. Do that. Alright, I think I'm gonna have to raise the tariff because I'm gonna have to start making money to fund my army. <sighs> my population is just shrinking so badly like there's like not much I could do about it sadly until I get rid of stupid um feminism crap but like I said it'll probably be very difficult to do so unless I somehow like fall to authoritarianism and now it can get repealed maybe all right so quantitative easing unlocked I've researched all the army tech What should I research now? Hey, you know what? This could help. Although I've already unlocked, I mean, I already went to war. But, hey, ooh, get that done before the end of the year. Less than six months. That's pretty damn good for very expensive tech. I'll help my war justification next time make it be 10% quicker. Do that. A hey, modern fighter, go over here. Alright, let's lower the tariff. 70% and take these ships over here too as I'm still building all these ships and of course I actually did some experiments off screen while I was doing a Denmark and Iraq game let me see my navy right here combined together yeah I got probably way too many light ships like I think I got some like cruiser still I can't tell if that's a cruiser or not. Or frigate, I mean to say. Like, really, really old ships that you could build at the beginning of the game. I probably need to get rid of them very soon. Alright, so... Let's go and lower that... No, oh, no, 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 no! No, no, no. Don't do that again, game. I hate when you do that so much. Alright, there we go. Try 65%. Ooh, getting closer. Getting closer. 
to 65 points. That way I can eventually ban him. And then maybe if I take over, I think it was this part, they'll have access with Shocker Republic, which could be an interesting option, maybe to attack right there. And expand outward. And then maybe go into Mongol um actually sphere by Mongolia, so that's not really an option right now, looks like. Alright, up here we no 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 go up there and we're gonna lower the tariff again. As let's go throw some money. Okay, I've already did. I think I threw a whole bunch of money into a whole bunch of countries before I began the last. I mean, well, after I did the last episode, so I don't think I can do. Yeah, it looks like I can't. Sadly. All right, so so we're now into September. It was, ooh, give me, give me free prestige. Thank you for that. Appreciate that. And, of course, my troops are still taking forever to build, since, of course, they can only build in Seoul or Pyongyang. It can't build anywhere else. That's something I like better in EU4 compared to Vicky 2. All right, let's ban him now. Let's secure it. Ban embassy. All right, there we go. All right, at the end of the... When we go into October, that's when I'll attack. Burn off some infamy. infamy get my troops some more time to get over here. I wonder if my, um, yeah, it looks like, oh, it's right, I'm progress, my, um, government's progressive, I don't think they allow work on um, infrastructure. And here we are, October. Alright, I think I can go attack them now, yep, here we go. I'll take that. Time to die, Far Eastern Republic. Hopefully they're not going to be too much, I don't think, who the, oh, okay, right here. Alright, so I've got to take care of this. As Age of Protest is about to be unlocked. Hopefully I can win this war because I'm not really... Okay, that's 18,000 troops. So I'm a little bit worried they might be kind of mobilized pretty damn good. Oh, good, the Republic of Arabia. So, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We still got our cores on them. Alright, good. We've removed them from America's sphere. Good. Let's go for naval tech for once. And with our extra national focus, let's encourage immigrants over here. As I think we're in uh, November now. Yep. Let's split up these troops. I don't... Yeah, go over here. This is the province I think we're trying to get. All of... All of the, oh my goodness god, that is gigantic. Oh. Oh man, we're gonna be split up. That sucks. I, I could have swore the map showed it was gonna be like all of this right here. Uh, that means they're gonna be split up. I mean, I'm gonna have to attack them later if I wanna expand outward. That really sucks. Here we go, more prestige. Guys, right, come on, unpause. Come on, I don't know why you're paused still. Just go in already. <sighs> oh my god. As more troops are getting built slowly, but hey, I've gotten three brigade. I mean, no, ten brigades, I think, built so far this year. That's pretty good. But I need to go up much quicker than that. Oh god! Oh god, that could be trouble. Go over there now. We gotta help out. Okay, they got up a whole bunch of troops right here. I'm gonna have to mobilize myself too. Just to be safe. I'm gonna have to start sending them over. No, 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 no. Now you can stay there. Looks like we got rid of them, at least for right now. Alright, so that will wrap up 2047 as we're now in 2048 now. So, we'll see what happens in the next episode as they're getting ready to attack me again. So, see you guys next time.